How are you feeling right now? I feel great. I, I feel like the seven days really flew by. So I, I definitely didn't want to leave my house at first with a splint on my nose, but I, th I think that like, I feel like I, I, feel, I feel really good actually. What was the hardest part of, of healing, of the whole process? Uh, for me, I think it was, you know, I, I, I feel like I didn't have any pain really. There was really no pain. I feel like after the third, even like the second, third day, I was like, I don't really don't need, you know, pain pills anymore. Um, I would really just do a little bit of icing and that was would take care of any kind of uncomfort I would have or discomfort I would have. Um, but yeah, nothing was really, I think the worst part was not wanting to be, not wanting to be seen. I think that was, that was the worst part for me, is not wanting to be seen with a splint on my face. So you said there was almost no pain. There was almost, honestly, there was really not a lot of pain at all. Um, the first day, you know, the anesthesia is wearing off and you kind of feel a little woozy, but that's, you know, some people don't feel anything, some people feel, feel it all, so no, I, I really feel like I, I was, it, it was good. Perfect. Okay, yeah. And what motivated you to actually decide to get this procedure? I just really, I never liked my side profile. I, I mean, I love, I love the way that I look. Um, and I think I'm beautiful inside and out, but there was just one little thing that I really wanted to tweak almost. And, uh, it was just getting the hump taken down. The side profile for me was something that I really did not like. And um, yeah, it was just, I saw videos on it. I did so much research on it, did before and afters. I did this, I did that. And it was the final decision that I wanted to just get my nose done. And I did. Absolutely. What advice would you give to people who are gonna be undergoing the same procedure or considering undergoing the same procedure? I think I would, I would say to really do your research to really go and look at the plastic surgeon and, and their before and afters and the videos that they have on their website and really like really see what you want to do because I looked through millions of photos and I like I wanted to find the photo that looked like me and so I could kind of think okay this is what I'm gonna look like afterwards and with Dr. Nyack too I chose him because I did all this research online and he had all these videos and he had these videos of a girl that came in, I think her name was Oz, and she came in and it was her, it was the start of her surgery to the end of it. And it made me feel like, okay, well that's what I'm gonna go through. She made it look so easy. And now that like I'm here, it was, it was great, so. Yeah. Any final words you wanna to give to everybody out there watching? Um, no, I mean, if you, if you do not like your nose, if you wanna get anything done, any plastic surgery whatsoever, and you have the funds to do it, do it because it'll make you feel so much better about yourself and it'll make you feel like, okay, yeah, like, I, I not that you look good, but it'll just, honestly, it'll make you feel better. So, so each is your own. If you wanna do it, do something.